cold morning out here, guys. You can see our breath. The grass is frozen, fog all over the river right now. There are duck hunters all over, so hopefully we do not run too close to them guys today. But we are looking for walleye and smallmouth. Those are, I would say, our main target species. You know, I can't complain if we run into a few pike or largemouth, but that's what we're primarily after. We are gonna use top waters, little swim baits on the bottom, moving baits, chatter baits, spinner baits, and definitely crank baits. We're gonna try everything, see what works best for these fish. Major cold front just hit. Not sure what the program is gonna be, but there's only one way to find out. Let's go ahead and go in the water and get casting. There we go, starting off with top water. Got our spot lock on. Yep, he came back for it. Fish on, baby. Didn't take too long. We got hooked up. And it's a, it's a largemouth bass, what the heck? There we go, just throwing the top water. My dad is throwing, what are you throwing, a paddle tail on the bottom? About a little less than a pound. So start. Fish on, you're number one. There we go, first smallmouth of the day. Two fish, two species. Not a big one, but. Look how big. wide his belly is, man. Cool fish. That's the target species. All right, so the gear we're using are medium, fast action spinning rods. I have 20 pound braid as my main line with a 12 pound fluorocarbon leader. I believe you just have straight 12 pound fluorocarbon on there. This new trolling motor, the spot lock is amazing. Our old trolling motor did not have that. It was just a cheap basic one, but we finally had to upgrade because our old one bit the dust. But this spot lock's nice. You don't have to do anything. You just stand in one spot and cast all over this whole entire main point. There we go. Yes, sir. On the fall, on the paddle tail. Feels decent too. Oh yeah. Decent fish. Holy crap, dude. That's a good fish. Gotta be still a lot of head shakes. Gotta be a small mouth. Yes, sir. Nice smallmouth. Dude, holy crap, that's a nice fish. He's fighting me, go ahead too. There we go, my first fish on the paddle tail. That's actually my first smallmouth of the trip. Probably a little over a pound, pound and a half, not that big, but right before we scooped him in the net, he chucked up a bunch of bait fish. Look how fat he is, man. They are feeding up for real. Two of them, two bait fish. See you, bud, thanks for biting. That fish ate it as it was falling back down. I'm just slowly jigging it up and down. And whenever I let go and it was falling back down, I felt him pop it. So I knew he was on there. All right, so we changed our plan. We were fishing some main points, caught three decent fish, two small mouth, one large mouth, but we are now at a wing dam to hopefully find some walleye. That would be pretty nice. We're gonna try throwing some deep crankbaits. This is a DT-16. You got a DT-14 on, I believe. So two deep diver crankbaits. No time. Oh, you got one? There you go. Dude, that's insane how clean that water is. It's like crystal clear almost. I'm gonna boat flip them ready. Show that color. How fat that belly is. Not a big fish at all by any means, but on that DT16, nice drag oh, color. Fat belly. <laughs> yep. The water's so clean. Nag. No. Dude, it's a big one. Don't pull too hard. If it Holy crap. I don't know right, what boy. it is, but it ain't moving. Hey, hold on a second. I want to at least see him. Don't horse him too hard. I'll, I'll go toward him. Give me that net. I wonder if you just... What the hell? You got a monster walleye. Oh. Big ass. It's drum a drum. <laughs> it's a... What do they call it? Sheep head? Yeah. You want me to net him? Yeah. <laughs> Look at that. Scoop him. He's tangled up the hook now. <laughs> Crap. There you go. I mean, it's a fun catch though. He was pulling hard. Fun. I thought for a minute it was just a big old catfish. 
But I mean, look how clean this water is. Big dummy. You there release him slowly. Thanks you know, watch this fish. Look at that, man. Back into the depths. Tough. There. You on? Dude, I was just jinking on the bottom real slow. Something just hammered it. Please be a giant walleye. Dude. It might be another sheephead, though. I was just barely doing this on the bottom, and he went smack. Keep that tension, boy. Dude, I just want to kill it. Want me to chase him? That's a walleye, dude. You think so? Yeah. He's fighting pretty weird. <gasps> no way. You lost him? He just went smack and came off. <laughs> dude. All I was do did that hook break or did it just get buried? Your hook broke. Dude. I was just on the bottom going like this. Look. In the same spot and it went smack and just took off. <laughs> dude, that was a big fish. That's man. a VMC jig head. Why did it break? Dude, that was a big fish, man. Oh my god. Dude, it was bigger than that one. I wouldn't even I couldn't even move it. It was just going. Got one. Literally first cast. Feels small though. Huh? Smallmouth. Guys, we got a smallmouth in like 20 feet of water out here. <laughs> Holy crap. Did it hit the bottom? No, it's a, it is a walleye. It's a sauger. Sa sauger. Sauger. There we go. What is that? Third? No, fourth species of the day. Alright, well he's not that big, and I'm not sure exactly what the limit is anyway, so we'll go ahead and let him go. Thanks for biting. It's been a pretty slow day. So we decided to move out past the wing dam. Now we're sitting in 25 feet of water, casting in probably 20 feet, and we're bringing it back toward us. It's 12 o'clock and the water temps are 57 degrees. Yeah, that's another thing. This water is insanely clean right now, so the fish probably are a little bit more spookish. Whoa! Fish on? Second cast. Is it a smallmouth? Yeah. And I'm Smoke. snagged. Bad little smallie. Tell me you cut on. DT16. Oh! Dude, oh, dude there's like five of them. Are you serious? There's a whole school of them chasing this thing. Are they still? They're, they're still? all right there. Hold on. Dude, they're all piled up together. Let's we'll see if we can double up. Dude, that's like two back to back. We decided to come back up inside the wing dam. Shallow water. We him in, there was about at least three or four more of them right beside it chasing that same bait. That's crazy. Large mouth, small mouth, sauger, drum. Is that all? Big pike in the pad. Oh, look. Hey, net, 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 net. That's a nice one. Look at that. He shot out of the pads. Right in the molly pads. I saw him shoot out of there. Where you at? Right here. Get ready, right here. Right here. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'll take a pike. Was that fifth species? Decent pike. I mean, nothing huge, but I just missed a really nice one that swiped out. I was not paying attention. Had a few more follows. And I caught this guy up inside all those lily pads, just moving it through the little openings. Sure enough, he was in there and he came out and smashed it. We're gonna go ahead and get him back. Okay, that's what I thought. Oh my goodness. Oh look, there's no one following. Flick! Hey, put your lure in here. I ain't got one ready. Flick! Flick! Oh! Let's go ahead and get this guy unhooked, put him back, and look for a bigger fish. Quite a few on the chatterbait so far. I mean, nothing big. That was so cool. I almost had that other one. He was chasing him, so I kept that fish in the water. Dipped my other bait in there, and he swiped at it, but... I missed the hook set. Hey, I got one. First cast. 
Hey, guess what bait I'm using? It's yet another different bait. Let's we'll see if he's got any followers. I don't see anyone with him. And these guys fight so freaking hard. Lipless crankbait, baby. I want a white and orange bellied raffle lipless crankbait. Here you go. First cast back to the wing dam for about an hour. And then we're probably going to finish off the day fishing some more points. But we'll see what happens. Got one? Good one. Please stay on. If you need to loosen your drag, do it a little bit. Stay on, baby. <laughs> I'm nervous, man. It's a big ass smallmouth. What the heck? That's it? No, it's a drum, dude. Is it? Yes. I thought it was a walleye. Smallmouth. I couldn't tell into the water. That's your fish, guys. Another drum. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Kind of depressing. There's one. Oh, I have no idea what this is. Feels good. We got a good fish on here. Huh? I don't think that's a drum. It kind of feels like a bass, but it's a nice fish. Probably 15 feet of water is where that fish was at. Not that time. <sighs> oh my gosh. Oh my God. Oh my God. If this comes off, I'm gonna cry. He's getting tired now. He's coming up. You can see the leader. Another drum perch. That's a big walleye. No. That's this just a big drum. Oh my. We can't get away from these guys. Bring his dumb ass over here. <laughs> oh my goodness. Hey, at least we know what it is. This place is loaded with drum. We might as well get, get it. He hit it hard. I thought it was a walleye. Or, or walleye or smallmouth. And those head shakes. All right, guys, we've got yet another disappointment. I thought it was for sure a giant smallmouth or a walleye because he was fighting hard. Smashed it really hard and just big head shakes. But biggest fish of the day, just another sheep's head. I mean, that's a big one. Fun fight. If that fish would have popped off and we wouldn't have saw him, dude, I would have been so angry right now. I mean, it's fun. It's fun, I guess. Go ahead and get him back. See you, bud. Back to the bottom. Doing a little 3 8 ounce jig head. I'm doing a pink jig and a 4 inch swim bait. Is he a walleye? Yes, sir. Oh my goodness, guys. What a day. Yeah. Unbelievable. What the hell is that? Is that a big ass buck swimming in the water? It is. Get over there. Man, look at that deer. What is he doing? What is he doing? He don't know what he's doing, man. Swimming across the lake, across the river. Wow. You guys ever see a buck swimming across the river? Wow. I don't know what that guy's doing. Michelle? Well, it's starting to look a lot better now. After a pretty slow day, this afternoon bite seems to be a thing. Another one. Burp, burp. <laughs> You're gonna be oh my goodness. Life. Fatties. Let me just wait till tomorrow. Alright. Oh, 
Oh my goodness. It's a saw guy because it's got the black dots and it's got the white tip. So I believe this is a little saw guy. I foul hooked him though, so it doesn't really count. There's one. There's a pike. I was watching you. We got him. Oh boy. <laughs> buzzbait pike never gets old, huh? Black buzzbait never lets me down. The day is coming to an end. We are about to call it. We are about to head back to the ramp. Can't end without at least trying for some top water fish. What? I want to cast by these stumps real quick. Oh, got him. That's a big one. Yes, sir. Look how fat that pike is. Holy crap. That's a good one. Let's get that net. <laughs> Last minute fish. That's bigger than I thought. <laughs> the bait is gone, dude. He destroyed that buzz bait. <sighs> last minute fish. That was like one of my last two casts of the day. And I got a, two nice pike. The other one was small, but this one's decent. Cold, look at them bloody tails. Not bad, I'll take it. Destroyed the top water. And we are about to call it the sun is setting. Set this guy free. There he goes. Man, hasn't been the most insane day, but we've caught a good amount of fish. Yeah. That's it right there. Day number one is over. How long were we out here? Like nine hours. Nine hours or so. Yeah, it was a pretty long day. The bite was not on fire. Like I said, there was a huge cold front that just hit. So we weren't sure what the program was gonna be, but we caught them on a variety of baits. Moving baits, top waters, bottom baits, a little bit of everything. And we had a lot of fun out here. It wasn't too cold and we will hopefully get on some more fish tomorrow morning. And that's pretty much it guys. We're tired and hungry. We're gonna go home, go to bed, and get up early for the next day of fishing. So if y'all enjoyed, make sure to smash that thumbs up button, subscribe to the channel. See y'all next time.